Russia may transfer fighter jets and air defense equipment to Iran. Russia is considering providing Iran with modern fighter jets and air defense equipment to protect it from Israeli and U.S. attacks. Military cooperation between Moscow and Tehran has reached a new level, reports the Washington Post. According to the data, Iran has opened a new dangerous chapter in its relations with Russia by agreeing to supply thousands of combat drones and missiles in 2022 to help Moscow in its war against Ukraine. The expanded ties helped cement deals between Moscow and Tehran, including Russia's promise to provide its ally with modern fighter jets and air defense technology that could help Tehran bolster its defenses against any future Israeli or U.S. airstrike. It is unclear how many systems have been delivered and deployed, but the Russian technology could turn Iran into a much more formidable adversary with enhanced capabilities to shoot down aircraft and missiles, officials and experts say. The arms deals, some of the details of which have not been previously disclosed, are part of a broader cooperation that includes joint production of military drones in Russia, sharing of jamming technology and real-time assessments of weapons deployed against NATO and in Ukraine, intelligence officials and arms experts said. According to them, this cooperation brings significant benefits to both countries while elevating Iran's status from a junior ally to a strategic partner. Intelligence officials said that Russia is pushing forward with secretly concluded deals to supply Iran with Su-35, one of Russia's most powerful fighter bombers. On the defense side, Iran has long been asking Russia for the latest anti-aircraft missile batteries to protect its nuclear and military facilities from a possible US or Israeli attack. In 2007, Tehran signed a deal to buy the Russian S-300 anti-aircraft system, but Moscow postponed the delivery of the weapon due to pressure from the United States and European states. The voluntary ban ended in 2016 and Iranian S-300s became operational in 2019. Since then, Iran has sought to acquire the more powerful Russian S-400 system, although it is not publicly known whether Moscow has taken steps to supply S-400 batteries. Some S-400 variants are equipped with radars capable of countering stealth technologies used by modern military aircraft. According to intelligence officials, Moscow also benefits from this cooperation. In addition to the thousands of drones purchased from Iran late last year, Russia agreed to buy about $2 billion worth of additional military goods, including anti-drone defense systems, which have become a top priority for Russian generals in Ukraine. Iranian media has released footage of drones and missiles being launched during an unprecedented attack on Israel on Sunday. Iran carried out largest drone attack on Israel in its military history, firing hundreds of drones and missiles against Israel in a retaliatory attack that came as a response to an Israeli raid on the Iranian consulate building in Syria two weeks ago. Shells also flew from pro-Iranian forces bases in Lebanon, Iraq and Syria. The Israeli military claimed the strikes caused only minor damage to Israeli territory. The missiles and drones were intercepted by the US and UK. Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps IRGC, confirmed the attack, saying that it had achieved its objectives. The Israeli Defense Forces said 99% of the Iranian salvo consisting of over 300 killer drones, ballistic missiles and cruise missiles were intercepted and pledged to retaliate for the attack. Iran's attack on Sunday was condemned by Western countries and raised concerns over major escalation in the region.